Sources say Canadian veteran Dave Lavery arrived in Taliban-controlled Afghanistan this past Monday. It was Remembrance Day. He'd planned to attend a ceremony at the British Embassy there, but he was intercepted at the airport in Kabul, driven away, and he hasn't been seen or heard from since. It's believed he's being detained. There's been no official word yet from the Taliban. Global Affairs Canada confirms it is aware of an incident involving a Canadian in Afghanistan. And Lavery is no stranger to that country. The retired Sergeant Major served for more than two decades with the Canadian Armed Forces, including tours in Afghanistan. And after the Taliban lost control of the country, Lavery launched his own private consulting company in Afghanistan. Now, when the Taliban clawed back control of Afghanistan in August 2021, Canadian embassy staff had already fled the country. There were no Canadian soldiers there. Lavery was the only Canadian on the ground at the Kabul airport trying to rescue former military interpreters and other Afghans who had supported Canada's mission in that country to get them onto evacuation flights. Those efforts earned him the nickname Canadian Dave. And Lavery had continued that work in the years since, working with veterans groups, including the Veterans Transition Network, to get vulnerable Afghans out of the country. A lot of deep emotions. I spoke with Lavery about that work on many occasions. And we also met Lavery in Ukraine after Russia's full-scale invasion, where he was doing the same thing, trying to rescue people out of the war-torn country. Now, sources say Lavery was doing that work in Afghanistan with the knowledge and support from Canadian veterans veterans groups and the Canadian government, which is now working to secure his release while dealing and negotiating with the Taliban, a group the Canadian government considers a terrorist organization.